Welcome to Sony's Bluetooth series. In our episodes, we'll introduce Bluetooth, some pairing procedures, explain NFC technology, and suggest essential troubleshooting tips. Bluetooth is a wireless technology that allows you to connect devices. It has become very widespread across the electronics industry, it's energy-friendly, and has been around for consumers since 1999. Simply put, Bluetooth acts as an invisible cable between devices, allowing the transfer of data over the air. There are plenty of Sony products that use Bluetooth, Xperia mobile phones, wireless headphones and speakers, but also some amplifiers, televisions and more are equipped with this convenient technology. Every Bluetooth device is designed to do specific things. It depends on the Bluetooth profile. A Bluetooth profile defines what kind of functions the device can perform, play audio, control another device, send data, and much more. You can connect two Bluetooth devices by pairing them. Pairing devices is like having two people meet for the first time. They introduce themselves before they become friends. Similarly, devices need to introduce themselves too before they become Bluetooth friends. After being paired, devices will easily connect when they are powered on, near to one another, and Bluetooth is activated. To put up device in pairing mode, you need to follow a simple procedure, but it might vary depending on your product. For example, you can put your Xperia phone in pairing mode by tapping the Bluetooth icon or by visiting the Bluetooth settings menu. The phone can then detect Bluetooth devices nearby. Other devices lacking a graphical user interface can be more tricky. For example, many Sony headphones can be set in pairing mode by pressing and holding the power button for over 7 seconds. Once activated, they become detectable to other devices, such as your phone, for a couple of minutes. In a nutshell, pairing procedures might be a bit different depending on your product. Don't worry though, you can check the exact pairing procedure of each Sony product in their help guide or instruction manual. You can consult these on the product page of the Sony support website. Every manual contains a separate section on connectivity and pairing. In this video, we'll show you how to pair the Sony Xperia 10 Plus with the WH-1000XM3 headphones and the SRS-XB41 wireless speaker. When you unbox and power on your Sony WH-1000XM3 for the first time, it will automatically go into pairing mode and be detectable. This easy first-time pairing mode is common to majority of Bluetooth products. But, if you want to pair more devices, you can put the WH-1000XM3 in pairing mode by pressing and holding the power button for about 7 seconds. A blue LED indicator will start flashing and the voice guidance will state Bluetooth pairing. It means the headphones are detectable. Note that the audio cue confirming the pairing status varies by product. Next, find the Bluetooth settings menu of your smartphone. Once in pairing mode, the WH-1000XM3 should be displayed as one of the devices nearby. Tap to pair. Like the headphones, when you unbox and turn on your Sony SRS-XB41 speaker for the first time, it will automatically go into pairing mode and be detectable. If you want to pair more devices, press and hold the power button until you hear the voice guidance and see the indicator quickly flashing. The speaker is now detectable. Next, find the Bluetooth settings menu of your smartphone. Once in pairing mode, the SRS-XB41 should be displayed as one of the devices nearby. Tap to pair. You can also use Near Field Communication, abbreviated as NFC, to pair your Sony products. We cover this in a separate episode. If you are struggling with Bluetooth pairing, please check out our episode on Bluetooth troubleshooting.